this painting won first prize in the first John Moore's Liverpool exhibition, now known as the John Moore's Painting Prize, held in 1957. At the time the artist Jack Smith was linked with kitchen sink realism. Such paintings included domestic interiors cluttered with everyday objects. They had earthy and rather drab colors. Smith, however, was not interested in depicting real life. As the title suggests, he was concerned with what he described as the capacity of the everyday to become miraculous or mystical. It's always been important to be true to the DIY aspect of this project. I don't have a lot of high-end tools or even a formal workshop. And so these constraints, you know, the limitations of tool and budget really shape my design decisions for this kitchen refresh. I do think there's a difference between a DIY approach that simply shops for components and collages them together and one that thoughtfully considers and reinvents or rethinks an off-shelf component. So to me, that's both the challenging aspect and the reward of practicing as an architect, you know, inventing a design solution to a problem. For design inspiration, I looked to museum and restaurant spaces. I wanted this rich, dark material palette with some wood accents, clean surfaces, and dramatic lighting. And all of this was to highlight this minimalist set of curated functional objects, very different to the visually cluttered space we were living with. The backdrop to our living space is the cooking wall, and we began our work there by removing the open shelving, the backsplash, and the old range hood. For the new backsplash, we cut three quarter inch tempered hardboard panels. These kind of interior skins or sheet goods, they're actually very affordable. British painter and occasional sculptor, born in Sheffield. He studied at Sheffield College of Art, 1944 to six, and then, after doing national service, in London at St. Martin's School of Art, 1948-50, and the Royal College of Art, 1950-53. In the mid-1950s he was a leading figure of the kitchen sink school. A typical work of this period is Mother Bathing Child, 1953, Tate, which does in fact feature a kitchen sink.